gentlemen. A big thank you to Lloyd's List uh, for the opportunity to be here. And also a big thank you to the judges uh, for picking us among the finalists who are uh, themselves uh, really good at what they do. Uh, this award ties in very well uh, with NRAM's philosophy or aim to change the world. Uh, perhaps it's appropriate to say to change or make changes in the shipping industry using data. And uh, hopefully this is uh, a big motivation to our team to continue uh, towards our aim and goal. Um, I'd like to accept this award uh, on behalf of everybody at NRAM. I'm very really humbled and thank you very much. Mel Ben from Anirang, and congratulations for tonight winning the Big Data Awards. So I uh, just wondering, uh, in your opinion, how can uh, Big Data help vessel operation nowadays? Well, uh, the shipping industry, as you know, is very traditional. Uh, they have been working for decades, uh, several decades actually, using known reports, voyage abstracts, uh, which are the traditional means of communication. But I think with the modern ways of communication and the speed at which uh, data and communication takes place, uh, it is about time that companies realize that uh, getting data in real time is important. In the past, you, if you had 24 ships, then uh, you got 24 known reports. And if the ships were in different parts of the world, in different time zones, then you probably got 24 known reports, uh, which means one known report you arrived at the office every hour. So if you had a meeting in the morning, it meant that you had one known report which was an hour old, and you had another known report which is 23, years, 23 hours uh, old. And uh, therefore, it was very difficult to compare between the 24 different ships. But today's world, if you have data, and data that's coming in real, time based on the communication that you have today, then you can compare all the ships, how they are doing at the moment. And I think that is uh, very important if you want to have a competitive advantage compared to your uh, competitor or uh, another company like yours who's competing there based on just on known reports. So you get real-time information about ships, you can make real-time decisions, you get a lot of uh, business support and business intelligence from these information, you can make uh, decisions before anybody else makes and 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 get the advantage uh, that you can you can have because of them so i think uh, big data and data that comes in real time is more important in today's world and uh, it also helps you uh, looking forward to make decisions without without making the mistakes that you've made in the past learning from uh, the mistakes or errors that you've made in the past uh, so what kind of uh, information you think is uh, necessary for today's uh, ship owners? Uh, they need all information that they can get their hands on. Of course, the information has to, re has to be uh, relevant, it, ha it has to be reliable, uh, it has to be dependable, and this information uh, should be also uh, stored in a secure way so that it can be used uh, in the future. Uh, to do things like analysis of accidents or incidents or uh, even business decisions that have made that have been made and turned out to be a mistake so so people can go back and analyze these things uh, it will also help uh, to he to help companies to internally analyze and compare their own staff on how they make decisions uh, how those decisions influence the ships how those ships uh, take action and real time get feedback so the, the entire feedback cycle is much quicker and much faster as opposed to getting a voyage abstract at the end of the voyage or getting a known report every day or getting a monthly report from the ship. So these things help to react quickly to situations. Um, at the end of the day, you want to run a really efficient ship, a really efficient company, and you want to be more efficient uh, than, your com than, than a sister company or than a competitor. And, and that is the true, true measure of efficiency and the true measure of uh, business, of an efficient business that you run. Uh, so for, for, for every dollar that you spend, if a company does consistently well in terms, they make 11 cents to a dollar that they spend, and another company makes only 9 cents consistently for a dollar that they spend, then the company that makes 11 cents to a dollar is much more efficient than the company that consistently makes only 9 cents to a dollar. And I believe that 
going forward, if you have information coming to you in real time, those decisions and, and, uh, can be made and those synergies and those uh, insights that come from data and information can be exploited much more quickly and much more in real time.